it's almost a lockdown. So what do we do now? First off, chill the F out. Shops are still open. Ain't no need to rush down. Ain't got to cook the whole farm. You can still tap out. A pending minister's speech doesn't mean stake out. Stop the panic buying. Everything sold out. Ain't no point in wearing a mask, but y'all forming up crowds. Well, still, some of y'all flaunting off with being bought proud. We gotta give mad props to all the essential workers. It's not the time to microscope on what essential work is. Teachers, cleaners, cashiers, whatever your job is. But this shouldn't be an opportunity for employers to lay off workers. And please, stop bitching about school fees and shit. Everyone has to be paid still, ain't it? End of the day, someone's still teaching your kids, so stop complaining and start appreciating it a bit. It's time to think for the young and the elderly. Just count what's needed for your family. Forget social distancing. Practice social responsibility. Forget the coronavirus. Reassess your mentality. When the year started, who would have thought twice about breathing? Now it's just a quarter ended. We wonder when we can finally breathe in. But still, some of y'all were worried about the last day of partying, while some of them are worried if it's their last day living. Our daily lives are disrupted for sure, but it depends on us how long this goes on for. But I'm perplexed though. What y'all queuing up at IKEA for? This pandemic can turn into a panic even more. It's no longer just the front line. This is our time. It's time to be a part now more than ever. But the irony is to get over this circuit breaker, we gotta come together. It's time to reset and reflect, react, but don't overreact. If our opinions divide on this, we might as well throw the white flag because this battle might have started, but this war ain't over yet. Peace.